Hello, everybody. My name is Kedemo. Welcome back for another video of Anthem. We're going to continue this series. Uh, we can see your your boy right here. I already forgot his name. I'm not playing these games enough, guys. I'm sorry. But anyways, we've got a lot of things here. Apparently, it respawned me into the base, so pretty closer to where my objective is. We got to meet with Tassin, Yarrow, and Matthias. Basically, in the uh, in this underground system right here. We, uh, in the last video, we did a mission, a, uh, OP, not an OP mission, what am I talking about? Uh, a multiplayer mission, so that was pretty cool, that was pretty awesome. I did enjoy it quite a lot, guys. So, we'll see where it lets us off. We uh, got 9 hours left on this game. So, let's see what we can do with the 9 hours. I don't know if we're going to be able to... That's some uh, secondary mission right there. I don't know if we're going to be able to do anything particular. But I'm hoping that we are going to be able to do as much as possible at least. Now, for those of you who want to read all of this, you guys can go ahead and just uh, read it on your free time. We already are level 3. I don't know how far we can actually go for the levels. When you think about it. Uh, can we go, is it, does it max out like at level 50, 20, what's happening on that part? I don't know, well I try, I guess we'll figure it out in due time. Let's just talk to these guys. Alright everyone, I'm, I'm ready to talk. Freelancer. Thanks for the save. That trouble was unexpected. You often hang around outside the walls like that? Occupational hazard, but this was different. Something's making the scars more violent. I think it's the Dominion. We think they're back. I'm sure you must know Freelancer Yarrow. <sighs> I think Tassin's right. This feels like before the attack on Freemark. The one that set off the Heart of Rage? I don't really know the whole story. I do. Much of what I am about to tell you is not well known. My ward, Johnny, was there ten years ago. She saw it with her own eyes. What you will already know is that Freemark was one of the great cities of Bastion. Ancient, proud, prosperous. But most important, it held the largest and greatest enclave of freelancers anywhere. The freelancers, along with the Sentinels, guardians of the walls, protected Freemark and its people from the chaos of our world. Until one day, the Dominion arrived on their doorstep. Cruel conquerors from the north. The Dominion, the Sentinels, and the Freelancers would make their claim for Freemark that day. Each group, heirs in their own right to the legendary General Tarsis and her Legion of Dawn. One of our best, Freelancer Adams, led the charge as the Enclave leapt to meet the Dominion forces head on. My Johnny says the army was massive. The Dominion was led by Dr. Harkin, a man never seen before or after that day. He came to take the city at any cost. So they fought, outnumbered, outflanked, and outgunned. Free Lancers fought. They did well for a time. But the walls of the great free mark did not hold. 
The Dominion poured in. Adams, with many freelancers, made their last stand outside the city walls. While some, like Johnny, stayed to help who she could. When, without warning, the doomed sentinels fell back. But now I tell you that deep in the city, Johnny discovered what the sentinels all the Dominion didn't want to destroy Freemark. They wanted to capture an ancient Shaper relic that was protected deep inside the city. The Cenotaph. It seems this Dr. Harkin believed he had created a way for the Dominion to use the Cenotaph to control the Anthem of Creation itself. Arrogance. The Anthem will not be controlled. The terrible cataclysm, which was Unleashed that day, destroyed Freemark, destroyed the Dominion, destroyed everything. That cataclysm became the heart of rage. Some survived to tell the story of Freemark, but not many. Dominion must be back for a reason. I clearly have more intel to hunt down. Come and find me later. Yeah, me too. I'll contact you when I have something. I'll be in the Enclave. Well, all right then. That was uh, some some hell of a story right here. Faction system unlocked. All right. Access the faction system within the challenge tabs. All right. So we got three people in total, I guess. Uh, they all said they were going in different places. For now, we only have one mission. Visit Bazaar and meet with Prospero, which is right there. Let's that guy... Uh, he knows how to tell a story, that's for sure. Good door. That was a really great cutscene. Really great. Uh, it really me. It really sells me so far on the game, guys. And I almost want to buy it, guys. Almost. And not just yet. I'm not there just yet. So we'll see. In order for me to buy it, I would. I would need to want basically to play it on my own free time and just free roam. And it would need to be a lot to do in the free roam. If there is not a lot to do. Which is not the, really the case so far, unlike those probably a couple of secondary missions and everything. But aside from that, that doesn't seem like there's going to be too much. But anyways, a long, great cutscene. Let's see what this guy has to say to us. Hey there. I figured you'd make your way to me soon enough. You're the new freelancer I've been hearing about. Only the good parts. <laughs> oh, it's all good. The fact that anybody's talking about a freelancer is even better. Name's Prospero. I'm betting you're the one I've been waiting for. Yeah? Why's that? You understand being a freelance is more than just a job. It's about pride. Pride in doing something well. Pride in your javelin. Hasn't been much of that lately. Intolerable. Who wants to charge into a fight looking plain and simple? What kind of statement does that make? Not when you could fly in looking like steel thunder come to life. A fistful of lightning in one hand and a hailstorm of pain in the other. That's colorful. Is what I do. When lances want to make a statement, they buy something special for their javelin. Maybe custom decals or bodywork. I'm the guy they come to. We're used to. Hasn't been any demand. The forge can't even build anything these days. I'm hoping you can change that. How can I help? We need to fire it up again. That takes ember and someone with the guts to collect it. If you can find some, I'm back in business. We both are. I'll teach you how to craft things. Okay, I'll buy. 
What I wanted to hear. You'll need to search for Ember outside the fort. Bring it here and we can start getting this place back on its feet. Will do. Okay, guys. So, let's see what we got here. Outlaws unlock. A bunch of things unlock. Crafting is a critical to tool. So, what is this? Briefing, lighting a fire. Freelancers often find extra work doing odd jobs for the people of Fort Taz Tarsus. So, secondary objectives, I guess. It's also a good opportunity to explore the jungle. Yeah, it's basically free roam. So basically free roam to find uh, resources and everything. Uh, except an exit. Okay. So do I have ex uh, to accept any of these? I'm going to accept this, I guess. I really don't have a, uh, a choice, really. I don't think I do, guys. So we are going to do one of the free roams, I guess. Free play unlock. There we go. Free play allows you to explore the world by yourself. Collectibles, crafting, okay, good, good, good. So we can, now we can just explore the world, which unfortunately enough, I cannot do that on my own free time because only got uh, a couple of hours to play this game. So don't want to waste those hours trying to trying to just fly around yet, I guess. Ember piece is collected. So let's try to start an expedition maybe and figure it out in due time where we're going to find these pieces. All right, so free play tutorial. So I'm guessing we just go into free play, basically. Track mission. Now there is no track mission for us, I believe. Game mode free play, easy, start expedition. So what's the game mode really? Change mission. So let's look at our missions. To play a mission or enter a stronghold or free play, select the icon. Okay, there we go. So we, we don't have any missions so far. Yeah, we really don't have any missions, so we're just going to free play. That's fine by me. All right, track mission, free play. Let's start the exp uh, expedition, guys. Uh, let's do it. It's a public one, too. So, oh, and on, what is that? Social tutorial. Okay, so what if I go here and I say, per se, I don't want to, I want to be alone. What if I want to be alone? So let me see really quick. What did I do? Forge? No, it's not the forge. Summary. Can I not do a ne? Privacy settings. Okay, so is that it? Oh, there we go. Private and Tempest specific server with the squad. Use the public setting to allow others to join your game. Actually, I want to be private. I want to be private for this one. There we go. I'm just doing some free play. It's not available to free for free play or strongholds. Oh, okay then. Alright then. Looks like we cannot go free play without being with other people. Alrighty then. Looks like we are here. Free play. We can see all the people that there. are... So far there's only one guy we can see playing right now on free play. Uh, imagine the population is not going to be that high. We're, we're going to see. So we got to have some ember pieces. These are just AI. So... The AI is basically green. Oh shit, what am I doing? I don't know what I'm doing, guys. Uh, there we go. Always forget the controls every time I start playing again. Alright, let's go. So I've got the big, the big juggernaut and everything. A big colossus, which I like a lot. So we gotta find some pieces here. What are these little things? While we're at it, we're free playing, so we might as well... It's part of our mission to find some objects. They're way for us to find something in particular. Like, to know where we're going or we're just gonna... Oh, what is that? Hang on. There's a crate here. Arcanist. Oh, there it is. Okay, so these are one of... That's one of them. That's one of them right there, guys. Common item. Alright. Just gotta find a bunch of, uh, of these, I guess. The, 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 the decor... Like the way the, the world looks and everything, it's so I'm beautiful, guys. Close to your location. I'd be careful if I were you. What what is a scorpion? Watchtower of Araf. Alright, so I think we got a couple of things here. There's the scorpion nest. Ready? Interesting. Let's go down, guys. Oh, what is that? There we go. The rate of fire is not that strong, but oh my god, what are these? Okay, elite spider. What the hell? Hold on now. 
There we go. Okay. You know what? There's a lot of spiders here. What the fuck is going on? Let's kill these guys. I don't know what I'm supposed to do right here. Apparently this is some sort of spider nest and stuff. So might as well destroy it while we're at it. It's a secondary mission of some sort. There we go. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool, guys. There we go. Okay, so there's more... There's more things to destroy right here. We might as well do it. There we go. Elmo destroyed. That's it. Done. There we go. All of it. It's destroyed. Alright, there's a secondary mission done right here. Don't know what's gonna give me or anything. Maybe I gotta talk to somebody. Got to the squirrel, the scorpion. Uh, okay. So I gotta destroy all of them. Let me get this health back. Yo, there's a lot of them. Gotta tell you right now, guys. There's a lot of them. That's crazy. Okay, let's see what we got. Can I change weapons? How do I change weapon again? Um. Uh, no, that's not it. Okay, I don't think... I don't know how... I don't remember how to change weapons, guys. I'm pretty bad at this. There we go. Boom. There we go. I'm just gonna punch the shit out of them every time. I just need to remember how to switch weapons. How do I switch weapons? I really don't know, guys. Oh, there we go. We actually did it. Actually did the mission. All right, well, that was not too difficult, but at the same time, it's kind of weird. Oh, there's something. There's a piece right here that we needed to find. There's one of these things right here that we needed to uh, get. There we go. I believe that's what we needed. A Colossus part. No, it's not even what we needed. Really now. Where we where do we find these uh, pieces and everything? I don't know. Let's continue to fly around, I guess. I I still don't know how to switch my weapons. Uh, is that how you switch your weapons? No. I really don't, guys. I I don't know. I have no idea. We gotta figure this out and uh, together. And yeah, let me figure this out. How do I switch my weapons? All right, I've found everything I needed to find finally, guys. I was a little bit of a dumbass for a little bit. It actually showed me a radar on my. I don't know if you showed it earlier, but when I respawned and everything, it actually showed me a radar where I was supposed to go and everything, or in the direction I was at least supposed to go. So that's a good thing. That's a really good thing, guys, because I didn't have a radar before that. I believe I didn't see it at least. I'm getting an attack by from uh, every side here. So return to Fort Torzis, uh, which I don't know where it is. Let me just check in the map really quick. I believe Fort Torzis is right here. So and pre and pre free play. There we go. I guess that's how you do it. There we go. That seems pretty uh, simple enough. Just. And the free play and everything. Okay, there we go. Expedition complete. Finally. Thought that mission was kind of dumb though. I wasted an entire video on that mission, guys. And an entire 40 minutes of gameplay. It was skipped. That was wasted for that bullshit. Like, I could have done that on my own free time, honestly. But oh well. Level 4. I'm gonna... I'm gonna skip all of this. I don't really need to see any of this. There we go. Skip all this. Thank you. Exposition ended. Please choose where you want to go. For Tarsus, please. Okay, let's see what we got here. We're going to speak to it as Prospero. See what he was going to give us in exchange for that bullshit mission that we had to do. I know it's tutorial and everything, but god damn, that was long for... Too long for too much. It's just too much. All right, then. Let's get to business and fire up the forge. It's time all these javelins around here got the tender loving care they deserve. Head on over to the forge, and you can start crafting. But don't forget, when you want to make a statement, maybe polish that javelin up with a nice coat of pain and thunder. Come see me. So, you're the thunder merchant, huh? Hey, the best freelancers always arrive with a bang. But first, they buy it from me. Don't be a stranger. Okay, so... He sells, basically he's gonna be the one selling everything. 
now I already upgraded my Colossus and everything. I probably have some more stuff that I can do with it. With these new upgrades. I've got a lot of coins, but what am I supposed to uh like use these coins on really? I really don't know guys. Robot epic robot, like I don't need that. Graphic, I don't like I, re I really don't need any of these. None of these seem really cool or anything. Epic Ember, like masterwork material. So uh, inscribe uh, equipment during the masterwork level. Like I don't, none of this seems really cool guys. I'm sorry, but I've got plenty of stuff that they gave me for free, but why, why would I spend it on bullshit? Like honestly, I don't feel like it's really useful. Let me just see on that map uh, over here uh, though. I do feel like the vault over here, I do need to do some stuff. Uh, weapons, uh, so assault rifle, empty. I don't have anything. Okay, so marksman rifles. What is this? So I can't do anything with that? Nothing so far, I think not. Okay, so components. Basic components, we've got something else right here. Melee inscription, that's interesting. Okay, so gear, do I have anything else? Colossus. We got two new stuff. We already have that, the Railgun and Venom Sniper. That's interesting. Alright then. Don't think we have too much here. Let's speak to Tassine. See what she wants, because I want to get as much of the story as possible. At least in this video. What is this? Another thing to add to the Cortex, guys. You guys can read that. Okay, let's go. I have another job for you. I'm flattered, but I still don't really know you. Old habit. I work for Corvus. Ah, spy. My job is to keep tabs on threats to Fort Tarsus. I have an agent embedded with the regulators, a group of smugglers. She keeps the really dangerous stuff from the wrong buyers. But her last report said there'd been an incursion of foreign operatives in the area. Who are they? Like I said before, I'm betting Dominion. Which means trouble's coming our way. Big trouble, if you're right. I think trouble's your idea of fun. Start by meeting my agent at a regulator camp here. Learn what else she knows and go from there. We'll get it done. Okay. So here's our next mission incursion, guys. It's going to be interesting. We're going to do this, of course, in the next video. The Strider Path to Free Mark begins at Fort Tarsus. Organized criminal crime. Okay, accept and exit. There we go. So that's going to be the mission right there. We accepted it, now we just gotta go into our Colossus and enter the mission, guys. I think I'm just gonna leave it here. Remember to leave a like and subscribe if you did enjoy the video. I know it was kind of a shitty video in itself, for me at least. Don't know for you guys, maybe you enjoyed it. If you did, you're, you're awesome already. But, um, I don't know. We didn't do too much in this video. I don't like free roaming that much. For especially that game, now, free roam looks fine, but... I wasted 40 minutes, like I don't have the time in the world, I don't. I didn't pay for the game, I only have a free trial, so I have only so much time that I can waste here, monologuing and everything, or like, doing some free roam, I can't, I don't have time for free roams, that's what I'm trying to say, so, keep it easy guys, I'll see you for another time.